I'm the shit flick critic. G'day everyone and welcome to another shit flick quickie. Before I get started, just a helpful reminder to subscribe and do the bell thingy if you haven't already, and with that being said, let's jump into it. For those of you who are more familiar with my old reviews, about three years ago I looked into a video called Country for Life by Virginian rapper J.R. Lyon. Yeah, country, country for life. Yeah, they better get it right. Yeah, I'm a country boy, yo. Yeah, on that country boy flow. Yeah, I'm a country boy, yo. Life for life if you didn't know. I had an interview set up with JR that eventually fell through, but I've recently arranged another interview and thought it would be a good time to catch up on JR's portfolio. I've had a look at some of his more recent work, and I do think that he has improved quite considerably, although he had set the bar pretty low. A lot of his raps now are centred around his struggles to make it in the rap industry and get signed, like in his latest rap video, Show Me A Sign. I said, Lord, show me a sign, so I know that everything gonna be okay. Yeah, I'm tired of the stress and the pain that I deal with each and every day. Hey, it's like I'm going through a storm, yeah, you know what I say. So much anger and pain and the pressure and the tension on the brain that people don't see or they don't understand. Consider Considering some of JR's other work, it's not too bad. It's very honest and from the heart, and I think it's one of JR's strongest songs yet. It obviously isn't without its fault. He's got Sure in 1998 level auto tuning. And he looks like he's being filmed against his will, but all that aside, I think it's relatively competent. The last time I looked into JR Lyon's YouTube channel, I commented on the sheer amount of videos that he makes. I gotta say, this dude has churned out a ton of stuff. See, I wasn't lying. And three and a half years later, he's still pumping out just as much. It also seems that JR has moved from the medium of rap into reggae, a genre that he appears to be just as proficient in. Ooh, yeah, I pray. Yeah, I pray. Yeah, I pray. There's also an amazing video of JR reacting to his own Country For Life music video, and just when you thought that song couldn't get any more unbearable, he has two different audio tracks playing at the same time that aren't in sync with one another. <laughs> And then he begins to rap along to the song, also out of sync. I think my favorite comment has to be, why are you reacting to your own video, Richard? What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck, Richard? JR's vlogs continue to be just as riveting as before, like this vlog in which a large portion is him grooming himself, making a very unenthusiastic attempt to work out, and just sitting in the back of his parents' car. Like I said before though, I do suspect that JR Lyon has some form of learning disability, so it does feel like low-hanging fruit just to persistently ridicule the guy, and indeed people do. JR still has a dedicated group of people on YouTube that spend every waking hour insulting his music or his appearance, but for every hater he has, he also has devoted fans that support him in his every endeavour, which is nice to see. As I said, I have an interview with JR coming up. I've never done an interview before, so I have no idea how it's going to turn out, but I'll let you know as soon as it's done. And thus concludes another shit flick quickie. As I said, keep an eye out for the interview and I'll see you in the next review.